Hello and welcome back to more SpongeBob SquarePants. Battle for Bikini Bottom. Maybe the next thing we have to do to do is the Poseidon. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Poseidon. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. That kind of dome? Oh, it is that kind of dome. I have brought you to here to face a great challenge. I've got nerves of steel and muscles of sand. And eyes of jelly. My Poseidon has been bleached by a mighty foe whom you must vanquish. Bring it on, your highness. Bring it on. In this corner, defending the Poseidon, a small square guy. And his challenger, a huge murderous robot shaped like a squirrel. Look, it's a giraffe. It's Sandy, you idiot. Okay, it's the Sandy battle. Don't remember how to do this. Looks like the robot left itself on Robo. Okay, I didn't do it right. Alright, I figured it out. <laughs> ah, damn it. I didn't get away. Fight for my life? I want to fight for my life. I wonder what that button does. You know, the one that says boom. Such an electrifying match! Oh, the 
That was fun! Your turn, SpongeBob! Oh? Uh... Wee! Wee! Oh, the ring has been cleaned up. Slow for a squirrel. Nice move by SpongeBob. This match is just about over. Not if I die horribly. Why does that sign over there say whisk? and flowers. Oh, thank you. It all means so much. I... I... I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Cry all you want. But not here. We just wax the floors. Wouldn't wax make the floor hydrophobic? Hey, Plankton! Yes, what is it? I was just wondering why all the robots seem to be coming from inside the chum bucket. Have they? I really haven't noticed. Uh, yeah. And then there's that big flashing neon sign that says, Robot Headquarters. SpongeBob, I'm your friend, right? No. No, not really. Exactly, and as your non-friend, I worry about you. Like right now, you're thinking too much. I'm worried you might really hurt yourself. <laughs> Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna think for you. This way, you won't hurt yourself. And you can just keep working on getting me into the jump bucket. Thanks, Plankton. You're the best non-friend a friend could have. No more thinking for me. Okay, then. No more thinking for Spongebob. Let's see, how do I do the... Ah, like that. Rest home. What's Mermaid up to now? I mean, knockoff Mermaid wow, Man. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy, my heroes! Hit me with a water ball. Hit me, hit me, hit me. Yeah, we don't do that stuff anymore, kid. We're retired. Barnacle Boy's mouth flaps a little too hard. Is that the TV repair man? No, it's that excited sponge kid again. Boy, look at his mouth flap. Oh. Uh, are you sure he can't fix the TV? Mermaid Man, it would be my greatest honor to fix your television. Goody! <laughs> hey, Sponge Kid, you really want to help out? No, oh boy, would I? Okay, then. Uh, but lighten up a bit on the enthusiasm, huh? Uh, you're making my bowels act up. Uh, we've got a little problem with some robots down in the Mermelair. Are you sure you're up to this task? Absolutely, Barnacle Boy! 
Well, go over to the couch to access the Mermelair. We'll meet you down there. Is it pudding night yet? Hmm, pudding. Crab Checkers, the king of Crab Contact Sports. Bikini Bottom News Update. We're getting unconfirmed reports that the robot menace is emanating from the chum bucket. The proprietor, Plankton, has released the following statement. Hear me now. I'll crush you all beneath my... And now back to your regular programming, Retirement Home Girls Gone Wild. What? What? I fixed the TV. Uh, maybe. This is a big. Oh. I fixed the TV. Asterisk. Before I go into the mermelayer, I believe there's something I needed the bubble bowl for. Bubble 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 bowl. It wasn't spelunking, so... I don't remember where it was. It must be a sock since it's not a golden spatula. Dead. <laughs> Tartar sauce. you have that? Why do so many people have golden spatulas? Oh god, Spongebob's face. I should probably get out of here before Spongebob dies. Oh hey Patrick. Thank you. 
It's not there anymore. Alright, to the Marmalaya! <laughs> Mermaid Man was very disturbed by what he just saw. Yes, we've been over this. You shouldn't sneak up on Mermaid Man like that. His heart's not so good. Come to think of it, nothing on him is that good anymore. Sorry, Mermaid Man. It's just that I'm always so excited to see you two. Standing in your awesome presence gives me the chills of justice. See? I've got goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps on my... All right, kid. Knock it off. Just tell us what you want. Well, I really want a new pair of sunglasses. Patrick said on my old ones. That's not what I meant. Oh. <sighs> Actually, it's a good thing you showed up, young sponge of goodness. It is? It is? It is? Yes! A bunch of evil robots have taken over the Mermelair security system. It's up to you to Shut it down and stop them! Well, why him? We're perfectly capable superheroes. <laughs> because it's Thursday and we have a whole bunch of doctor's appointments. Ah, fish sticks. I forgot. Go talk to the Mermelair computer in the next room. She'll tell you what to do. I accept this awesome responsibility, Mermaid Man. You won't be disappointed. Shamed, maybe, but not disappointed. Shamed, maybe. To the doctor's office! Away! They didn't even get a good impersonator from Mermaid Man. This robot is named Arf. Use the bubble ball to defeat him. Running away. Alright, there we go. Oh, 
him. Doesn't seem to work. Come on. Am I doing something wrong? Wrong sign. No. Since I don't know how the how the paddle works, apparently, I'm gonna go somewhere else. But I'm appreciated that my bubble bowl works. Probably go to the 25 one first. Let me teach you how to bowl a bubble. Press this button and you'll bowl. Wow. Remember though, the bubble bowl only works on things that are close to the ground. Got it. Oh, on top of Shady Shoals.
Excuse me, I need that, uh, need that bouncy thing. SpongeBob has a problem. I don't have enough golden spatulas. Hey, Mr. Krabs. Treasure chests looking a bit light, boy. Do you think? Well. Okay. What's in the police station? This is the robot viewer. Step on the metal square in front of the viewer to activate it. Use the viewer to read the case files of captured robots. Hey, um, I'm er... Very interesting. Aha, I assault the desk clerk. And there's nothing you can do about it. Goodbye. Welcome to the dark depths of Rock Bottom, home of strange creatures and souvenir t-shirts. That fish just wet itself. Glad you're here, and believe it or not. I'm glad I'm here too, Mrs. Puff. The robots have stolen priceless artwork from the museum. If you can return it all to me, I'll reward you with a golden spatula. Why do you want all that artwork? Don't ask questions you aren't prepared to handle the answer <laughs> to. <laughs> oh no, I'm doing illegal stuff for Mrs. Puff. Consider the artwork saved, Mrs. Puff. <laughs> 